As the title implies on this Tobacco University video, we're going to learn how to identify and control armyworms in cannabis plants as well as at the end seeing one actively feeding on a cannabis plant. All right, let's get into how to identify and control armyworms on cannabis plants. So first off, the general description of the armyworm. Uh, when we're looking at the um, armyworm, there's yellow striped armyworms, as we can see in the above pictures. There's also the one of the largest, this is one of the largest uh, and most brightly marked of various caterpillars that might be found on hemp. There is then also down here the beet armyworm. Uh, this is a caterpillar that feeds on leaves and developing flowers, fruits, seeds of a great many plants. We're going to see the one pictured later of the yellow striped armyworm variety here. Very distinctive coloration and very aggressive feeder. This is the adult stage, so be on the lookout for that as well as part of the general life cycle looking at armyworms. So when we look at the identification of them, uh, it is a generalist feeder that feeds on the leaves of a wide variety of plants. It's not specific just to cannabis. This shows the adult bee armyworm um, kind of moth, and this shows the bee armyworm feeding on a hemp flower. So again, very different coloration than the yellow striped one. Now, managing armyworms, just in general, here's that yellow striped one, cultural controls. Corn can be planted as a trap crop so that will attract them to that, and you can spray and control them on the corn, and hopefully they'll avoid feeding on cannabis plants. Tillage, uh, since overwintering occurs in local soils, soils as a pupate, tilling will help destroy them and reduce their population pressure for the following year. Then there's also biological controls, which is the use of egg uh, parasitoids. There's biofungus uh, that can, uh, especially particular strains that can really attack them. And then as a last resort, typically there's insect in insecticides, biofrin um, as, as the active ingredient. Now, if you want to know just how quick these can feed on a cannabis plant, I captured some video of them actually feeding on a leaf, and you can welcome to view that now. All right, in this video, we see an army worm eating a cannabis plant. Now, the audio is not necessarily true to the actual what was going on, but we can see in real time just how aggressive one of these caterpillars can basically be. These worms are how quick they can eat and devour a plant. Uh, you can see here really close to the bud, so that's of course of concern. And usually where there's one, while well, none pictured in the image here, I'm sure there's a few more and this implements more scouting as well as control.